Good morning, good morning, good morning. Wakey, wakey, wakey. Hey, you guys, who all beat the song with me once again this morning? Yes, out of all days that I want to sleep in, today will be the day. But my body wouldn't let me. My body said, heck, you know, I'll get your ass about me all the way up. We don't do that over sleeping over here. So I'm like, oh my goodness, I just want to rest. I just want to lay down. And my body said, nope, up now. <laughs> so I was up washing, um, rinsing out a few dishes. I'm cooking breakfast, rice, turkey sausage, turkey bacon, cinnamon rolls. And, and that's about it. So if you hear the stove just going off and clicking and pickling, that's what I'm doing. I'm cooking. Um, Welcome to Vlogtober Day 5. We still going strong. Very proud of myself. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Whoever is watching. But uh, today's topic is treat yourself and enjoy your own company. <laughs> you can take that in any way or as many ways as you want to. So, the first part is of this topic is treat yourself. I don't care what you do, and I don't care how simplistic or how extravagant it could be. It could be as simple as going to the salon and letting somebody's fingers run through your head for a good minute. It could be going to the massage parlor and letting them massage the muscles that you've been working on all year round and they've been touched. I don't care if you go to the mall and buy yourself the most expensive thing. You deserve it. Especially if you're taking care of everybody else and not yourself. Meaning you got like 50, 100 family members in your pocket. In your household. Around you. You got friends in your pocket. In your household. All around you. You got your co-workers in your pocket. In your house. All around you. You got the strangers in your pocket. In your house. All it, it Take a moment in the day to get some solitude and treat yourself. <laughs> That's how we gonna do that. <laughs> you know, we gonna do that like that. We gonna take some time, get cute, do something we wanted to do, do something we've been putting on the back burner, do something we've been wondering and curious about, and we gonna go and do it. Yes, we will. Yes, we are. Yes, we will. And we're going to do it often. And we're going to like it and not feel guilty about it. You know? Because it's it's very important to take care of yourself. How are you going to be any good to somebody else if you're not taken care of? You're not looking out for self. You know? And in this cold, harsh, stanky, predictable, unfair world we live in, <laughs> You better take a little time out to treat yourself every once in a while. Do you hear me? Do you understand me? You understand me? <laughs> you know, because you'll regret it. You'll be 20 today and 85 tomorrow wondering where the hell the, your years went. Trying to keep up and uh-uh. No, baby. Now, ain't nothing wrong with looking out for others. That's what you're supposed to do supposed to look out for others, but ain't no way in the world you're supposed to be looking out for everybody and not looking out for yourself. Always putting yourself on the back burner. Ain't no way that's supposed to be happening. No, we're going to change that today. Alright? So, the next part of the topic is enjoying your own company. Now, again, Y'all could take this as simple or as many ways as you can possibly imagine. I just feel like this could go full circle all across the board. Also, enjoying your own company. Solitude. <laughs> you know? Um, you want to always have people in and out your house. And you wonder why there's so much drama in hell. All those different personalities and entities come on because <laughs> you know you got them people who just let any and everybody in their house everybody could sit on their couch all over the place it's no boundaries it's no 
Oh, it ain't no sacred space. And you wonder why it's so much hell. Because you're not taking the time out to enjoy your own company. You can't enjoy... Um, you don't want to be in the house by yourself. You can't go out to eat by yourself. You can't go to the movies by yourself. You can't go to the mall by yourself. You can't go to the park by yourself. You can't drive anywhere by yourself. You can't do this and that. You damn near can't take a shower by yourself because you just so goddamn lonely. You just gonna accept anything in your life. <sighs> what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do with these certain individuals? And that goes for people who with these crazy boyfriends. You know you deserve better. But because you don't want to be alone and take time for yourself, you will put up with trash and nonsense that you really don't have to put up with just to say you have somebody. Let this person take you. It can be a boy, a girl, sugar daddy, sugar mom, anybody. You let them get your car. You let them get in your wallet. And, and, and you just let this person invade they self into you and you just ain't got no room for nothing else not even for yourself it's crazy that's complete ludicrous lord that's complete ludicrous <laughs> and i'm just trying to figure it out i ain't figuring nothing out. i already know what it is i'm just you know i already know the mindset the um thinking process it's just Insecurity's got a lot to do with it, being lonely. And this is my thing. How is the 7 billion people here in this loneliness? You're going to have to comment down in the comment section and help me understand. Because ain't no way it's 7 billion people here and it's this much loneliness across the globe. Like, really? You can't find one d And that's another thing. I had a question. When I got up this morning, I said... Yo, why all the kind, loving, sweet, positive people can't be on one side of the earth and all the negative, stanky, funky, negative, irritating, just out of this world people on the other side? I know the answer to that too. But for some reason, I keep asking myself that question. That question really comes up and I already know, that. know the answer to it. And it's almost like, well, you know, because your goal is to not only be happy here somewhat, but you also have to let your light shine. Comment below if you knew that. <laughs> you can't. We can't be separated because we have a task at hand. We have to let the most highs light shine through us and be an influence for them to change. How can they change if they're around their own kind? You know, they got to be in. My thing is the ratio is off. Like why got to be one to one billion negative people? It could be one kind person in a room full of negative. Like why the ratio got to be off like that? Like why the ratio can't be equal? You know? Why can't be a room half of the kind and half of the negative? It got to be. It's so. We are so far apart from each other. It's ridiculous. Like, it's easy to spot a crowd of negative, worldly people. And then it's so hard. It's so hard to come across those precious gems, those kind, loving, you feel. Feel the love. You feel that high vibration. You feel it. Oh my goodness, you feel it. And it's just like, I want more of it. And I can't come across it because we are so far apart from each other. You know, we so far apart from each other, but that's the task. It was not never going to be easy. The task is, we're going to put a handful of y'all here, and your job is to be an influence and let my light shine through you to transfer and change these people's hearts and minds and let them see different, that they don't have to be like that. But they could also be here, come from out of there, and come over here, you know. It was not never going to be easy, but I'm off topic. Let's get back on topic. Solitude. Enjoying your own company. Why is that so hard to do for most? I like a peaceful household. I like peaceful energy. 
I don't have to be in anybody's face 24-7. Nobody has to be in my face 24-7. Hell no, that would actually annoy me. Like, you don't want to sit down? You don't want to go home? Do you have a home to go? You in my face? I love you, but it's time to go. I need solitude. Like, seriously. I need time to walk around how I want to walk around my house. I need time to do what I want to do and not worry about somebody else's opinion, thought process, comments, concern. I don't, mm -mm. I love my alone time. I cherish it. It feels so good to just have a moment to yourself, you know, and not always have somebody on the phone using your ears as a damn trash can it's always something it just can't be a peaceful day oh my goodness i need something i'm in your pockets what your check look like can i do this can i do that can i borrow this oh my goodness i need to stay no oh oh no <laughs> oh no 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 yes we gonna fix this right now so my thing is the key to a peaceful life is you know it's okay to love your loved ones. Nobody's saying not to do so. But also take a little time out for yourself also. Because what good are you to somebody else when you're not okay? When you are not okay? When you're not good? When you're not, you know, where you need to be? How good are you to somebody else when you just give, 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 and nobody's giving back to you? That's not fair at all. But again, we don't live in a fair world. We don't. Nothing here is fair. So, what do I know? <laughs> but certain situations, we can make fair. Oh, I guarantee you, we can make it fair. You know. But, uh, yeah. That's, that was, you know, a little bit I just wanted to touch on today. You know, put that out in the atmosphere. You know, because I know there's a lot of people out here that need to hear that. And nobody around them cares enough to tell them that. So, you know, you come here and hear it from me. Because I care. <laughs> yes, sir. Um, I love my peaceful life. You can't tell me nothing different. I don't miss nothing. Now, it is boring. It don't have to be boring. But it's just your options is slim to none. When, you know... <laughs> you know what I'm trying to go you know what I'm trying to say but it's you know when you live a peaceful life is a lot you have to give up and a lot of people don't like dull and boring but it's it's like you give up this to receive this you can't be in a club and get serenity you can't be out on the street and have peace no, you pick one or the other. You and that's what I'm saying. All the people I wish that was like minded, kind hearted. We are so far off. it's so hard coming across people like that. And I just wish I don't wish I'm glad it's how it is. I just wish the ratio, like I said, was up. Because if I could just have all the kind people around me, I'd be good. But I know that's not realistic. Even then, if I just had everybody that thought like me, who's to say I wouldn't get annoyed off of that? <laughs> you know? Because we just think so much alike and act so much alike. Uh, you know, but it's peaceful. Yeah, but a lot of people need that drama. They need that excitement. So, it's a price you pay to have drama around you like that. To not have a born, dull life. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. So, you know what? I'm not going to hold y'all down too long. My breakfast is cooking. I'm going to relax today. I've been up and on the go. I can't get on here and preach to y'all about treating yourself. And I'm just on the go all the time doing it. No. Cooking me a nice breakfast. I'm going to find something new and cute for myself to do today. It's Saturday. I got the whole day ahead of me. I'm going to find something cute to do today. By myself. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that one. That's that's my little, that's what I'm going to do. Find something cute and new. It got to be cute and new. Something I ain't never done before. And um, I'll probably share with y'all 
don't know. I don't know, no, no. But yeah, you guys, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. A wonderful weekend. It's the weekend, y'all. Yes. So, take some time. You know, get some extra rest. You know, spend time with those babies. Do some shopping. You know, pay y'all bills. Some of y'all ain't pay y'all bills yet. Y'all better get them bills paid. <laughs> and then, go have fun. Yeah, responsibilities first. Then, you could go splurge on fun. Let's not forget about that. Alright, you guys. I'll talk to you guys on the next one.